Okay, okay. Um, you need a seat? Alright. You need that seat right there? There you go. There you go, guys. Speak up, guys. Speak up. Um, my name is Jesus Brown. I am the founder, creative director, and curator of the Honeycomb Experience. Uh, real quick, just to briefly say what that is. Uh, we are a social networking platform for entrepreneurs and creators. Um, and we do things such as the Art and Entrepreneurship Academy to try to get kids to think in an entrepreneurial mindset while allowing them to be creative and do self-expression. Um, we partner with LaShawn Kimber. She is a tutor with a um, founder of Let's Learn Charlotte. And also he can be here today because he started an internship um, to help an art career, but just for art. And he's an upcoming painter in the Carolinas. Um, the three of us that came together to create a curriculum broken down to six weeks. And what we're going to do with each week, we're going to take an entrepreneurial concept and we're going to spend the first hour maybe just doing some type of academic exercise just to get the mind thinking and then we're going to allow them to apply those different things that they learn to a canvas or any other type of art project that we might have for them that particular week. Um, along with that, we also do have guest speakers. All of them are African American entrepreneurs who are doing successful in their field. Um, I just graduated from Bluefield State with my marketing degree, and one thing that I did not appreciate was I was an entrepreneur, but I wasn't being taught by people who ever ran a business. So how can you teach me different experiences that I'm going through now and you just teach me from a textbook? Um, so I think that it's big to have you that actually in what we're trying to get the youth to think, to think like especially in today's society. Um, so I'm going to let Miss Kimber, she's going to break down the six weeks that's in front of you right now, go over that briefly, and then from there we'll answer any questions that you might have, all right? All right, hey everyone. Um, my name is LaShawn Kimber. Um, I am the founder and CEO of Let's Learn Charlotte. It is a tutoring and homework help service. Um, and I do service Charlotte, Gastonia, and the surrounding areas. Um, so right here on this paper, we have just sort of a breakdown, if you don't mind taking a look at it, um, just a breakdown of what we will be doing for those six weeks that um, Mr. Brown talked about. Um, my portion of the curriculum had to do more so with um, getting the kids to just have a mindset, an entrepreneurial mindset, and while fostering um, just some social emotional pieces. We know that this is a time of social distancing, um, and they are not able to be as social as they could be. So um, I wanted to make sure that we incorporated some of those things so that they not only have that mindset as an entrepreneur, but they are ready to go into society um, fully prepared. So if you take a look, um, we have week one, and that is what is an entrepreneur. So we're going to talk about what does it mean to be a business owner? Um, what does it take to be a business owner? There are lots of things that it does take. You can't just say, oh, I'm going to start a business and start a business. You've got to have perseverance, dedication, those things. So we'll talk about those things. Um, and specifically, we'll talk about self-discipline and self-management. Um, if you look at week two, we have social awareness and entrepreneurship. So we're going to talk about the things that are going on in the world and how they affect us. Um, we're going to talk about um, how we can change some of the things that maybe we don't necessarily agree with and how we can be influencers in the world. And um, we also will talk about how we can incorporate a small business within that concept. Um, we have week three, which is creativity and the entrepreneur. Um, just to be creative and to stand out 
out of the crowd as to how we are going to um, create a viable business and a viable um, small business so that we're just making money, but we're also being creative and thinking outside of the box. Um, so within that week, the students will learn just about um, different artistic abilities um, and how they can incorporate that into the small business entrepreneurship world. Um, then we have week four, which is financial literacy and the small business design. Um, how can I start my business? What are some of the things that I need? What is an EIN? What is an LLC? That sort of thing. So we'll incorporate that as well. And what we need to do to execute goals for our business and how we can open up our business. Um, week five is networking. We all know that word of mouth with business is key and is vital. So um, the things that we're going to be doing in week five is working on public speaking. Um, creating an elevator pitch if someone were to say, hey, what's your small business about? You are able to articulate that, so we're going to work on that. And then week six is the culminating piece, um, which is we're going to put everything that we learned in those weeks all together, and we'll come together um, in, event, in an event to showcase our new business. So it's not just learning about entrepreneurship, but getting those experiences and creating a new business for them to have that entrepreneurial mindset, but also to be small business owners at such a young age. So I'm really, really excited about it. Um, I hope that you are too. I look forward to working with you all. And um, yeah, that's it. Can we give them a round of applause, please, please? Right. Well, I'm not sure a lot of y'all know this, but one of the hardest things to do in life is public full heartedly right now, but you're never going to forget the seeds that are planted in this moment. So every time that you come in here, we're going to practice it today at the, at the, um, at the end of this. Um, we're going to, you're going to say your full name. You're going to stand up, you're going to say your full name. And I want you to get in the habit of practicing that. I want you to get one of the main purposes of this for you to be confident in yourself. All right? When you walk into a room, when you interview somebody, or when you're being interviewed, you need to be able to be confident in who you are and what you have to bring to the table. So, man, can we can we practice that right now? Can we can we can we stand up? Can everybody stand up for me? You know, adults, kids, you know what I'm saying? Let's, let's you know, let's do it. You know what I mean? Let's get up. Um, and then we're gonna go left, go. No. Okay. My name is Janaya Mack, and I am in the seventh grade. Okay. My name is Jazari Hall, and I'm in the eighth. My name is Gabriel Bird, and I'm in the sixth. Okay. Oh, you can hear. My name is Gabriel Bird, and I'm in the sixth. Okay. I'm in the sixth grade. Okay, great. So every time you come into class, when you take attendance, you want to stand up. You want to say your name just like that. On Thursday, when you arrive, you're going to get a bag for business full product on your own. Okay, we're just gonna help you get the blueprint, the map to do it, and if you feel like, okay, by the end of it, we want you to be confident enough to pull the trigger, all right? Um, that's actually all we have as far as the presentation is concerned. If you have any questions or anything specific, parents, you can ask. Um, some, I know some people, I need you to feel like a particular application, I'm gonna text it to you because it's digital. And then from there, you can print it out at the office. So if you can please, um, if you haven't filled out the application, if you can get with me. But if you have any other questions, you feel free to ask. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You got a question? No. Oh, oh you can say it okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, but honestly, we don't have anything else for you guys. Um, we're going to run on Thursdays. So every Thursday, 5 to 7. Loops, where was she yelling, hold up? Loops, where was she yelling, hold up? Yeah. yeah, I'm doing the things I want to. I'm doing the things I want to. Yeah. I'm doing the things that make you proud of me. Doing the things I want to. I'm doing the things I want to.
a little different Young black man on a mission, days get rough, my nigga, but no bitchin' I 